Chinese media has confirmed something that foreign observers and media have been talking about for over a year, namely that Zhou Yongkang, the powerful former head of the security and energy industries, is under investigation. This is part of a broader purge or corruption probe that's been going on for about a year and a half as the head of the party and the head of the state, Xi Jinping, consolidates his grip on power. Many people feel that corruption is a big problem in China and certainly there's a lot of support for rooting it out. But the way this campaign has been conducted also brings to mind some of the old time political purges and political struggles. And so many people see it as an effort to consolidate power under one man, Xi Jinping, and to root out many of the vested interests and power bases of previous administrations. One of the reasons there's been a lot of speculation about Zhou Yongkang over the past year is that his closest allies, including many senior executives in the oil industry, have been picked off one by one. And clearly the target has been Mr. Zhou. Uh, what still remains to be seen is whether there's a bigger target lying behind him. Well, in China, there's no innocent until you're proven guilty. I think the conviction rate in trials is well above 99%. And that's even more the case when the party, which has its own internal investigation procedures, which are above the rule of the nation, when it decides to take somebody down, it doesn't usually let them go. So the big question is indeed who's next, whether this probe will go even higher to some former leaders who have existing power bases that are seen as a threat to Xi Jinping's ability to run the nation and the party. Uh, another possibility is that it stops with Joe. Uh, that's the pawn that has led everybody to agree. And from now on, we'll see an ever decreasing purge with maybe some lower level officials continuing to be picked off, but the overall thrust of the campaign stopped.